Despite the chaos, these early systems paved the way for modern aircraft carriers, drone recovery tech, and even mid-air refueling. They were bold, bonkers, and beautifully ambitious. Lanier trained the first five generation of carrier pilots, many of whom would go on to fly in World War II. But in the 1930s, Lanier was obsolete. She was converted into a seaplane tender and reclassified as AV-3. But her spirit lived on. In 1942, she was ferrying P-40 Warhawks to Jablo when Japanese bombers struck. She was scuttled to prevent capture, but her latency was already airborne. Langley wasn't just a ship. She was proof of concept, a floating dare. She showed that planes could launch from ships, land on ships, and fight from ships. She paved the way for the Enterprise, the Hornet, and every modern supercarrier. Today, aircraft carriers are marvels of engineering, but they all trace their lineage back to sandbags, pigeons, and a former courier ship named Jupiter, the first to launch, the first to catch, the first to dare. The next time you see a jet land on a carrier with pinpoint precision, remember, it all started with a catapult, a hook, and a whole lot of guts.